Hi, betting experts. On Tuesday the 13th of July, first of all, look back at our two bets at air on Monday. We move on to Beverly on Tuesday. Competitive card, good to soft ground at the time of recording. The weather forecast seems pretty set fair. We start off with our value angle selection in the 215. This is the Racing TV EBF Phillies Novice Stakes, a five furlong class five. Two-year-olds only, 11 runners. £3,768 are off to the winner. Not many of them can be given any kind of chance and are likely to be seen to better effect in handicaps down the line. I think there's a vulnerable favourite in Dreams of Thunder, who I thought was flattered in a small field at Windsor first time out, where inches covered the first four home. And the other one in the market, Sophie Starr, where she has to give away a stone all round after a couple of wins. So I think it's pretty hard for her to win. So I'm going for Gentle Ellen of David Barron. Now this filly made a very promising start at Carlisle on the 27th of May when just touched off by Wee Lock Lass. Unfancied 12 to 1 chance there and very green. Then at Pontefract next time just did too much too soon up on the hammer at that stiff track fading inside the final furlong. Still finishing a creditable fourth. She's got potential to keep on improving. A very good draw in stall three and should go really close with some improvement to come. For our nap of the day, we go to the 145. This is the Taft Sergeant's Memorial Handicap, a five furlong class six sprint, three-year-olds and up with 17 runners, only 2,700 quid on offer to the winner, but it looks a good opportunity for Rose Bandit to win again. She's been really thriving, winning on the bridle in a cellar, one run back and then upped in class to make all the running and win impressively last time out. She has got a five pound penalty for that win eight days ago, but she's pretty well drawn in six under Mulren and hopefully she'll come out quickly, bag the far rail and make all the running to complete a quick fire hat trick. Best of luck on Tuesday betting experts.